How's it going, Z Warriors? Welcome back to another video of Final Fantasy 16, as you all know. Continuing, we're going to be doing another side mission. We have two more side missions to do, and then we will do the continue on with the main mission. And it's from her. Some ain't right with that hound of yours when it please your lordship. Oh, please your lordship, come pay me a visit at the. I'm wondering what's going on with Targol. What could be wrong with Torgol? Torgol, I meant. You seen well enough when I last saw him. Yeah, same. Hmm, I'm wondering what's going on. I hope he's okay. Oh, my baby doggy, he's okay. My baby puppy. My wolf, my jaw puppy. Ah, uh, wolf, are you okay, Torgo? Torgo, are you okay? Are you okay? What's going on? Tell me, Karen. I got your note. You think something's wrong with Torgo? Couldn't she just walk and tell me that? Congratulations. I didn't say I were wrong with him. I said some weren't right. He's not been eating me treats. He used to love cracking the bones from Molly's boiled brown, but now he won't so much as look at him. Didn't like him. Which is why I'm of a mind that his man's on somewhere else. You've not been working him too hard, have you? No harder than usual. Is that it, boy? Do you need a rest? We can give you a rest if you need it. What was it you said he was? A frost wolf? Yes. That's what the lawsman seems to think. Then Probably maybe it. this all has something to do with whatever it is that's woken inside him. I suppose things happen different since Rosaleth. Perhaps Hippocrates knows something. Instead of everything, you mean? Perhaps. You know what? Let's talk to the old Siggy Balls man up here. He might know something about it, because I sure the heck don't. Because he's a frost wolf. He's a de I don't know what frost wolves are like. Hey! Knowledge man! Siggy Balls man, do you know anything about Torgo's incident or not eating? Balsman, I need to ask Pre you about Torgo. Something's not right with him. He isn't ill, is he? I don't think so. But according to Lady Karen, he seems to have lost his appetite. Which is certainly a new development. Yes, it is. He says he's hardly been touching his bones of late, and she believes it may have something to do with what happened at Rosalith Castle. Hmm. Who knows? I rather think she might be right, though not about his appetite. All canids are instinctively inclined to crack open bones for the rich marrow that resides within, and I see no reason why a frost wolf should be any different. Okay, it makes sense. I suspect it is not a lack of appetite that afflicts Torgal, but a surfeit of it. If we assume that his newfound magics require additional nourishment to sustain, it may well be that the bones Lady Karen is accustomed to providing are no longer sufficient. Frost wolves, after all, habitually prey upon far larger animals whose bones may yield altogether different nutrients. As to where one might find a suitable substitute, some antelopes that graze the meadows of eastern Rosaria have been known to grow to a size more than double that of their lesser cousins. I don't recall ever seeing any that large. And little wonder. The oldest and largest such creatures rarely leave the safety of the highlands for fear of predators. The last elder antelope sighting I recall hearing about took place near Cressida, and that was long before the village was abandoned. Even so, it seems like a good place to start. Okay, off to the place that was Ben. All right, um, let's go. We just so Twirgle just needs a bigger bone. Okay, he's not satisfied with those dinky ones. All right, all right, get it, I get it. Um, let's go to the world map, y'all, and let's go here because this is where we have to go. I guess this is where we go. <laughs> Uh. All right, so we have to go with this place. Okay, we've been there. We know where that is. That's easy to get there. I'm wondering how big. Like, it needs bigger bones, I guess. You know, more meat. More meat, you know? Not just little tiny meat. More! Ah, the frost was needs the meat that oh, it can just rip into, you know? It doesn't take one bite to be done, you know what I mean? But anyway, I, I know what I mean, but if you all don't, whatever. You don't need to know what I mean, I guess. <laughs> but anyway, that's like me spider spirit. The lightning ball! Okay. 
How you like the little Shucky? Was it Shucky for you? Except for right, B Archers? Well, I mean, you're all weak, so it, I knew it wasn't going to take long to kill them. Let's destroy this one, too. There we go. 32 XP. I'm surprised. Torgal, we're going to get you some better meat. Meat in your ass. I mean, meat out of your ass. I mean, meat in someone's ass. I mean, meat. Okay, I don't know what I'm trying to say, y'all. <laughs> but we're gonna get you some tasty meat to chow down on. On a bone, alright? Or just a bigger bone. I guess when you have that beast, uh, the, the, whatever it's called, Frost Wolf, you know, your powers are lurking, it just makes you want something better, right? Maybe when you were your puppy? Um, I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe you have a, I don't know. I don't know! I just don't know. I don't know. I'm just gonna shut up. Can be. Oh yeah, we have a chocobo. I forgot my chocobo. I like that Boston. chocobo. My one of my favorite animals in this game, other than Tor Torgal. He's another favorite animal of mine in this game. But the chocobos—they're unique and they're big. <laughs> Coming through. I got places to be. I don't have time to deal with your it's big ass. Easy. I'm sorry. You can twerk away if you want. Go have fun twerking with those. Other beast of the giant. Thank you, Rose. We get a use of Scalabar! Oh, there's the antelope. Do you all see what I see? Attack, Torgo! Attack. Okay, never mind. I'll attack. I, I'll, I'll do it. Attack, Torgo! You hungry, Torgo? Are you hungry, Torgo? We will get you some food. We can't let you die, pup. Wolf. Frost Wolf, here's some bigger bones for ya! Better bones! Oh yeah, one down and another one to go. You're not running away, you get back here! That's right, you're not going anywhere, I'm sorry to say. Yeah! Oh, oh, how you like that? You didn't like that! Oh, what, did, that, did that hurt? Did that hurt? Oh yes, I kicked you! I kicked you right in the antelope ass! Oh, frick, we, we're keeping that thing from, like, even trying to touch us. Come on, Torgo, get him! Get him, Torgo, you got this! I'll let you defeat this one. Revenge! Revenge, Torgo! Oh, yes, go Torgo! Look at him, he's doing all of this work on himself! Come on, Torgo, you got this! Keep smacking the crap out of him! I'm just, just chilling back here, letting you do some work. Yeah, go Torgo. Go, go, go Torgo. He took that thing out by itself. Uh, you make me proud, boy. You make me proud. No. Want a treat? Will it be enough, I wonder? Is that good for you, Torgo? Or do you need more? Oh, you're happy. You get a bigger bone. Upgrade the bone. You're welcome, so Torgo. my question, which means we are the lawsmen. Our thanks. Yes, we do. You're just a big puppy, aren't you? A very big puppy. Yup. <laughs> Even he agrees. <laughs> you do know you can take that with you, Torgo. Lady Karen will be relieved to hear you've got your appetite back. Come on, boy. Yeah. Yay, Torgo. You got your appetite back, boy. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, I love that dog. Uh, I mean, wolf. It's a wolf, I know, but I, I'm still calling it a dog. I'm calling it a dog. I don't care what you all say. I'm calling it a dog. <laughs> Anyways, onwards back to Karen to let her know about Torgo is doing fine. Torgal's fine. I noticed you and Torgal had gone off somewhere. Took him for a walk, did ya? Kinda. More likely a battle. You could say that. Get more bones. Better bones. Better food. Better treat. I like that sword, y'all. Scalibur sword. So, Molly's leftovers weren't good enough, eh? That'll teach me for treating you like you're still a pup. Yeah, not a puppy no more. 
All right, all right, no need to shout. <laughs> now I know what you're after, I can see about getting some in. Speaking of which, I brought one for later. Can I leave it with you? Here you go! More likely you brought five, not one, Clive. Like, get, get with the program, I'm man. I'm nice like that. In return, you can thank Tomes for me. Is her eye blind, her left eye? I was just on my way to see him. Where are we now? I, I don't know what she said, to be honest. But we're on, let's see who? Who are we seeing? Oh, that dude, the Saggy Balls Man. Okay, I get it, I get it. Hey, Saggy Balls Man, you're a genius. You know, every, you know everything about wolves and other things. You probably read all these books to be so smart. Ah, Clive. Were you able to locate your quarry? Yep. We were indeed, Lawsman. You pointed us in exactly the right direction. Smart old Saggy Balls Man. Been a very happy hound ever since. Very good, very good. Lady Karen sends her thanks, by the way, for your part in solving the mystery. Ah. His name is officially Smart Seggy Balls Man. That, he got that promoted. Reminds me. After your last visit, I found myself pondering Torgal's talents. Do you recall our conversation concerning Lady Jill's role in Torgal's transformation? Yep. About how she somehow woke the power within him. I remember that. Precisely that. A reasonable conclusion, I thought. But one which raised certain kind of surprise. In my mind. <laughs> I usually don't remember stuff that well, but I didn't remember that. You see, the Fenrir of legend served Shiva and Shiva alone. And while the powers attributed to him are certainly impressive, the records imply they are somewhat different in nature to those you describe Torgal as having used. What are you suggesting? that Torgal may be the beneficiary of more than one icon's power. Cool. Consider that in addition to Lady Jill, he has served as a loyal companion to you, your brother, and even the late Sid. In short, the icons hitherto near at hand, or should I say at poor, have been diverse and plenty, and that number has only grown as the realm's dominance have fallen to your sword. One can but speculate as to how all of this has affected Torgal. He has seemed more fierce of late. And if I am not mistaken, he will grow fiercer still. We are fortunate indeed to be able to count him amongst our allies and not our adversaries. <laughs> oh, he's more than an ally. Yeah. He's a friend. No, he's more than a friend. He's family. That what you should have said. Not a friend. He's more than a friend. He's family. Okay, he's both family and a friend. It could be both. Wait a second. What did we just get? Did we get a necklace? It looked like a sexy necklace we got, y'all. Is it? It is, but it's not sexy. Even a legendary king surrounds by realms, great knights, and... Okay. Um, is this a necklace? Crease healing? I like that, though. Oh, no! I like all that. Oh, well. Let's see what it does. Like, I don't, I don't know what it does. <laughs> Um, is there anything at the hunting board? Doesn't... Oh, there's something at that... Whatever it's called. The lady, the lady, lady. Oh, look at Dorgo. It's all happy, happy puppy right there. A happy, happy wolf. A happy, happy wolf. A happy, happy... Be careful with those watermelon. Don't fall. Is that watermelon or is that cucumbers? Those cucumbers are, and carrots and broccoli and stuff. It looks like I hate broccoli. <laughs> I hate cooked carrots, but I like I like carrots, raw carrots. I don't mind. Let's go and talk to her. How may I help you today? I just want to see if I have enough. It looks like I do. So let's get this. You earn this. Yes, I do. Thank you. So the next one is 850, and that will unlock more resource things. Best of luck out there, Sid. Uh, thank you, girl. Thank you. Is there anything more on the uh, hunting board? 
Doesn't look like it. All right, I gotta go, little, little dude. Onwards, back to my room, back to my room, back to my room. We are off back to my room. Mom, 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 it's a wonderful day. Do you have anything, gold lady? Let's take it to these. If you're gonna buy some, be quick about it. How about shut up and don't freaking rush me? I'll do things when I want to do them. If I want to take my sweet ass time, I'm gonna take my sweet ass time. If you don't like that, then shut up. <laughs> or take a seat on this guy's ween. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. He cracked the crystal too. Anyways, back to the room we go. All right. No, we got something. We we just got something. I don't know what that does, but um, what is this? That's twenty five percent of that. I mean, that goes by down. Defense goes down. Damn. Um, increased strength tectonic during by 10 seconds. Um, okay, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? It only goes by 12, my attack. So we can put this on, because my attack only goes by down 12. We can just leave it like that and, you know, but yeah, let's just try this. Then eventually we will see if this does anything. Slightly increase Torgal attack, but okay, that increases Torgal's attack, okay. Oh wait, no, we almost have enough for that. But anyways, y'all, we're going to end this part here. So if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe for more content. And hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when a new video comes out. Like, share, do all that wonderful stuff. I would appreciate it very much. That's if you want to come back and support me. Because you enjoy the content. And that's why you subscribe. That's why the subscribe button is there. Because if you join someone's content and you want to keep on coming back to support them, you just smack the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified when a new video and you can be first here. And also don't forget to comment in the comments because I do like interacting. You don't have to, but it would be nice if you did. Because I do like interacting with uh, my viewers and stuff to let you all know that. And yeah, like always, viewers, I appreciate you all and stay awesome. Peace.